to do a video today on how much it cost me to get it right by T to start my body contouring business. And this is just like the basic cost that I'm gonna go over with you guys because I feel like a lot of people are just kind of like hopping in without realizing that it takes more than just a machine to to get started um i mean technically i guess you can just start off with your machine the first cost that i encountered was the machine okay and there are so many different options when it comes to machines. There are machines that are as low as $300. There are machines that are as high as tens of thousands of dollars. And I'm talking about your cavitation, radio frequency, and vacuum machine. There are so many different variations of it, but I believe that it doesn't matter what type of equipment you have or start with. I believe it's all about the technique so you can have the most expensive machine and the worst technique and your results may or may not be mediocre knowing the person's body type and working with all those things in mind the second expense that i had was supplies it was the um the bralette and the the thong the disposable bra and thong because the person that trained me had this she recommended that i have it so that when people come in they don't get their clothes all wet and soiled and stuff um i do see some people that use a towel and that's fine if that's what they want to do but this was part of my supplies so it was an amazon order um and basically she just sent me the links and i Click those links and I ordered exactly exactly what she had. The table is a perfect table. It's huge. It's the um, it's an earth light table. So like these are really popular with like massage therapists. Like, the next thing that I needed to purchase to start my body contouring business was a vacuum therapy machine because you're not gonna find a cavitation machine and a vacuum therapy machine together. They don't make them like that. So I got like the basic cupping machine. I wanted people to feel comfortable knowing that every time someone came in, I had a new cover on the table. So they're just like those paper um, covers that cover the table. You see them at the doctor's offices all the time. That was part of my Amazon order. So things that I needed to get started, those are like the bare basic, bare minimum. If you have a place you can start your business with just the machines, the um, the supplies from Amazon, your gels, oils, towels, table covers. You obviously you need a table. So that was around. Model work is extremely important. I know that you've paid, you know, money to get trained. You've come out of pocket for all your supplies and stuff just to start, but it would be really, really, really beneficial to you to start a model call, start calling people in. Look, you've already bought your machine, you've already paid for your supplies. So if you wanna do a couple of treatments on some friends and family members, just to get your photo game up, to get your practice in, to get your experience in, I highly recommend that you do it because at the end of the day, those photos are going to make all the differences in the world. Not only do you get photos and experience, you get to learn and experience different body types. You get to learn and experience different techniques because I'm telling you right now, like you learn one thing in your training. But that one thing is not going to apply to every single person. Every single person is different. You may get somebody in the door who can't have cavitation because of counterindications. You may get somebody in the door who can't stand the sound of the ultrasound. So you're going to have to come in with something else. So I highly, highly, highly recommend after you get everything you need to get started, you start 
doing model calls just starting out you cannot charge the same price as somebody who's built up <clears throat> before and afters who has experienced working on multiple people and has their technique down you cannot charge the same price i highly 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 recommend that you if you have to charge people charge the minimal rate i bare basic equipment and I started kind of getting people in working on them getting a little bit of experience after I felt like I was confident in selling my service and knowing what I was selling and being able to articulate exactly what I was doing for me that was like about um 45 days in any you know anywhere between like a month to a month and a half after i was sure of myself and my product and what i had to offer and i had some pretty good photos i then started on the advertising it's free to have you know all the public platforms obviously so pump your pictures out pump your before and afters out you know get make a video and get on um, camera and say hey this is the service that i offer this is what I can do for you, you know, come and see me. But I felt like at the time I needed some paper flyers. I needed to be able to go into places and have something physical and tangible to hand out to people. My Instagram is at get.it.ri, R-I-I-I-I. You could tell people that all day, but it is so great to have something that they can physically take and putting everything that I offer on the back of the flyer. I put my logo, the name of my business, and the phone number and website. I need to get a phone number that wasn't attached to my personal line because when you're in business, you may get like a lot of random calls whether they be advertising or you know people with a lot of random questions in time i'm at maybe um two and a half months in and now like i want to make my space look good because like i know i have the skill i know i'm confident in what i'm doing and now i want my clients to come in and like appreciate the room that i'm in so that's where decor came in. And I'm not going to really include that because you don't absolutely have to have a decor budget to start your business. But I will say that once I started profiting, like actually seeing um, profits from working in my business, I started to take that money and reinvest it back into like my room, you know, my decor um my um better maybe like a better quality of oil and stuff like that and then at about three months in i started to feel like i needed to upgrade my equipment now there was absolutely nothing wrong with the equipment i had like i said i had the pink and white machine i started off with that and i the white triangle butt machine i started off with those but now i knew that if i got some laser lipo pads that it would up my client experience it would up my results so i ended up investing in this, this machine right here the reason why i got that one is because i one not only up my results for my clients but two because i was starting to get people coming in and I didn't have a lot of time because I'm still working, you guys. I'm still my, I'm still being a mom. I'm still working, so I didn't have a lot of time. So when I would get two clients, I would schedule two clients at the same time, and I would have one on laser lipo, and I would be working on the other. You see what I'm saying? So it allowed me to not only up my results, but it also allowed me to fit to get multiple clients in at a time, maybe seven or $800. The next thing that I invested in was my wood tools. So the first set of wood tools that I bought cost me about $175. You guys, I just got the basics. At that point, I started to up the quality of the therms and things that I was using, okay? 
So that probably put me somewhere at about another hundred dollars in oils and stuff that I'm using. And at that point, we're probably now at this point about four and a half months in. I'm confident. I know what I'm doing. I've worked on a couple different body types, got a consistent amount of clients and referrals coming in. Maybe take a training in something else because you know I just wanted to keep adding on to the services that I were off that I was offering not because I wanted to get paid more money but because I wanted to be able to help more people I wanted to I had people coming in that they were like you know they wanted scope but they were like heavier clients and so I wanted to be able to do more for them because sculpting honestly is more beneficial to people who are already an ideal weight and size they just need some snatching or um focus on like one or two specific areas but I was getting a lot of overweight people who wanted more you know that wanted to lose weight they needed help and direction in that and so the next bulk um thing that I spent money on in my business was a new training fat dissolve liquid lipo I got and um meal planning and the science and education behind food around the same time I started to do a little bit more research and I started to want better quality equipment. But at this point now I'm in, uh, I have two rooms in the suite that I'm in. And so I was taking on two clients at a time, like I said. And so I ended up buying a second machine, which was the S-shaped mini. You guys have seen that before. And I bought another vacuum or cupping machine which also had EMS on it so now I'm help I'm working muscle I'm helping people define abs and my booty lifting techniques are permanent now because I am building muscle a second set of wood which I love I'm also trained and educated in hyaluron pin so I purchased that I'm offering those services I'm advertising on Instagram first I would say probably six months every just about every dollar that I made went back into the business I ended up doing um, around the time where busy season was tapering off was I started to invest you know what profits I did still have in products so um, I got a hyaluronic acid, which is great. And now you're seeing hyaluronic acid everywhere in everything. But girl, get it right by T. I was like one of the first ones to hop on hyaluronic acid. It's great. It's moisturizing. It helps prevent fine lines and wrinkles. Developed a booty oil. I also invested in these waist snatchers. And again, I built my website. So I threw those up on the website and um, those that was just kind of like I guess you could call it like residual income where I didn't even have to be present or anything to for that stuff to sell I would get a notification that there was an order what it was and I would just ship it out again I have these detox teas all oh, these are amazing that is pretty much how much it cost me to start my body contouring business we are coming up on a year that get it right by tea has been in business and I have learned so many lessons, you guys. Like I said, one of the biggest ones was if you have any questions at all, I am always available to answer any questions. If there's a video that I can make for you pertaining to body contouring, please leave it down below in the comments. If you found use from this video, I would be so, 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 so appreciative if you liked the video and also subscribe to my channel for more content about body contouring i am so very grateful for you guys it has been so so great seeing my numbers like climb a little bit i'm so happy and grateful for you guys I love what i do i love making videos for you guys as i stated before there was nothing out there. Like when I started, I was looking for information on YouTube, on Google, everywhere. And like, there was really nothing out there. So I would love to be that place for people to come if they have questions, like I said.
I am available. Thank you so much for watching this video. Like, comment, and subscribe. And 